What's going on guys? My name is Aura and this is High on Life. Hey, if you want to slow down time, it's ready. Gotcha. We got a new gun. She's eager to be used. So let's use her. Press right bumper. Pretty cool, right? You're going to find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian. Smartest, most useful, best looking. Uh -huh. No, no, come on, come on. I'm pretty good. I'm struggling here. Douglas, it's Garmatuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete fool of yourself at that party last night. Not good, Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. We're spread thin over on Earth, and I need more troops immediately. Not to mention things are gonna start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, Douglas. Get excited and get your fucking shit together. I cannot okay. wait. Yeah, fuck that. I cannot wait to kill him. What do we got here? What's this? Another Douglas assembly line. What? What? What is this? Whoa! Wait. What? They blurted out themselves. It looks like um various um balls attached to each other that's funny you want to fuck these guys up yes rapid fire you got it my god it's like halo's needler It is like the needler. Okay, so hit you and then stab. And now stab. We make a pretty good Hey, wait, is that at least somewhere else? Aim me at those fuckers and I'll charge up a super crystal. Let's go for the headshot, of course. Ooh. Okay, now I just gotta make sure I hit my shots. Ooh, and you can use that to detonate my smaller crystals. So just blast some normal shots, then finish them off with my super crystal. Oh. You got that dipshit? Wait, whoa, 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 I thought we were cool. Calling me dipshit, what did I do to you? The hell? So fill an MU with crystal, use rapid, then use a charge shot to detonate them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First, I gotta figure out how to get over there. Okay, I guess we're cheating. We're shooting through solid objects now. Why are you twerking? Let me shoot you in your ass. There you go. Crystal no the booty hole, that's what him. you get. Oh, now we gotta get across, huh? Hey, you wanna see what else this time bubble oh. can do? Yeah, I needed to that's what I needed to get that chest. Well I'm not gonna go all the way. I'm not gonna go oh, all the way back. Jeez, do I gotta spell it out for ya? Try slowing down one of the ships, then we can use it to hop across. Great, perfect. Now hurry and cross before it wears off. Okay, the only problem is Why'd you fucking fall? it might be Look, moving a little too fast. Do so much. You're gonna have to pick up the rest of the slack. There we go. The time bubble doesn't last forever, you know. Incredible, right? What a thrill. You know, you can use that time bubble on the G3 too. And try loading the bubble up with my crystals. Then you'll see why I'm the best Gatlian. <sighs> Just listen to everything I can. Never use the other what the? Ah, that was pretty easy. So Who's this guy? Next? You turned in the bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. Hey, I intend to. Don't worry. So with these guys. 
Okay, there's a portal right there next to us. That actually works out. But yeah, there was a chest right before um, we fought Douglas. And I knew I had to jump on that ship. I just didn't know how to slow it down. But we'll worry about that in another one. Another episode. Are you coming back home? Gene's being fucking annoying. What's this guy doing now? Seriously, get back here? Okay, I'm right here. I'm at the portal. Is that the last text? It is. Alright, let's go back. Kid. Another one down, huh? Great work. <laughs> but, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. Where's my sister? Go. Go, 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 go. Panthers. Go. Go, panther. go, 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 I was a panther once. I'm turning that bounty already. I gotta show you this. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. All right, good. Get over here. Wait, I'm gonna sit down on the shitty couch. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Clug Nugman, Blim City magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch this next bit. It's all about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Yeesh, desperate much? Can he even help us? I already told him you go. Oh, great. No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Club's expecting you. His name is Club? Okay. It looks like I talked to you for a quick Sorry second. for making the call without you, but uh, Club's a good man. I say we hear him out. Alrighty. Yeah. You know how hard it is to get a meeting with the magistrate? Don't keep him waiting. I mean, who cares how powerful? Oh, I'm in his office. Oh, what the? I'm just saying, this is space. They got flying cars. Everything here is futuristic. And he still has a ceiling fan. Just throwing that out there. They're not as Thank advanced as they so think. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. It wasn't really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much, and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works, or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Okay. I thought my plan was about to be destroyed. What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically human a drug. Cages. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems. Assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. 
As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. It's a nice view. Hey, you got one of these things. I saved them, you know. Give me a bonus. Hmm. I wonder if one of these guys... Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you like. I am. I'm investigating this fold. I'm trying to figure out which one's a bad guy. I feel like the robot can go rogue. And this guy just looks like a drunken uh, teenage turtle, so put him on the sus list. You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things oh, up. Oh, really? Yeah, be sure to check that out. Let's check out the view. Looks pretty nice. Kind of reminds me of Destiny. I feel like I'm in the tower. I won't ask to see your face, but I am curious. I'll bet you're covered in cool battle scars. Maybe even a All right, goodbye. badass. goodbye. Let's get out of here. Let's go get the next bounty. I think we've got two, three more. But now we got to save humans in Yo, cages. I didn't even sure. know they were being trapped. <laughs> it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yep. And he even gave us this weird thing we could save humans with. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Yeah, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head oh, back out into the field. Yes. Fight. You're really going to need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. They do. Oh, yeah, you might want to hit up Bordeaux's chef stand, too. It's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. No, I want a jetpack. Let's fucking go. No more bounties until you get a jetpack from Mr. Keep. The hell? Here we go. Okay. You think I'm kidding? You're barely gonna be able to get around this universe. I'm on the computer. Back. You'll want to relax. I was far. picking out the mission. I should have stabbed you when I had the chance. Guy gets to me. But yeah, no, I've been trying to buy that backpack since the beginning. I knew that'd be like a worthwhile upgrade. So let's get there as soon as possible. Get a little jetpack. Maybe it's a double jump. Maybe we're hovering around. Wait. What the hell? Wait, oh my god, why did I teleport? I'm already here. I could have just walked out the house. Hungry for some uh deals? Am I right? You Didn't you tell me to come here too? Hungry for some uh, deals? Am I right? Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I am Blordo. You here for the food or the other stuff? <laughs> what, what do you mean other uh, stuff? Yeah, nothing, nothing, stuff. nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine, I sell secret shit. If you know what to ask for, but don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Fuck yeah. What? Cutie Town Warp Disc? Okay, this one's free, so hell yeah, I'm gonna take it. Oh, good choice! This Warp Disc contains the coordinates to warp in an entire city? I wonder how that works. Alright, I got a whole city in my pocket now. We got movie theater, skate park, trolley, toilet. Um, what's number 10? Can't afford, it contains coordinates. Okay, sure, we'll get in a cottage. Huh. Let's save up for the most expensive. We're only two rocks away. For money. Goodbye. Use the money 500 to return to previous visit worlds and look at the warp signals. Okay, so I gotta... Oh, yeah, there was that place in the desert area. There were two warp areas that I did not... That I couldn't figure out what to do with. So I probably didn't have the right warps. Wait, what? And call you an asshole, but I need you to come over here right now. I don't want your fucking goop anymore, shit. dude. What what's do you that want? Guy yelling about? Stuff? Is he talking to us? What do you want? Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You want it cum or what? Okay. Hear me out. The goop came in handy. So alien come, I don't know. 
There's a real world we're in. I'm about to just skip all these dialogues and say, hell yeah, I'll buy some. Um... Yes? Fucking hell yeah, we'll buy some alien cum. Wow, you just went right for it. Didn't even ask any questions. <laughs> Didn't even ask how much it costs. <laughs> I knew I was right about you. I knew you loved alien cum. Well, here, have this alien cum on the house. Just tell all your friends about it. A gallon? This. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. Okay, I'm not going to eat it. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Flam City selling alien cum to the community. Say all. Looking for more alien cum, are you? Well, I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. But give me a little bit, and I'll have plenty more. I promise. I just... I just need some recovery time. No, it's his. Oh, my God. Let's check the inventory, though. Items. Where is this? Set out gallon. Oh, ugh. Oh, it's a jar. Ew, it's on the outside. It's heavier than you think. You gotta carry this around everywhere now. Um. Wow, you're really desperate for more alien cum, huh? Look, I done told you what I gotta tell you. I, I, it's gonna be a while, okay? You got my last drops of alien cum, and I just don't have any more yet. That's not how an uh, alien system of ejaculatory valves work, okay? Now, I wish I could help you, but I can't. Okay, I'm done talking to this dude. I want my jetpack. I was trying to buy a jetpack and I got a free gallon of disgusting mayo. No dialogue this time, fuckers. Hey, you I got know. Any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Yeah. Where is it? Oh no! Oh my god, I messed up. That's a scooter. Oh, sorry, partner. That's not for sale. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Is this it? Yeah, jetpack. Um, 99 buckaroos. 999, huh? Sometimes you gotta get up real high. Ah, uh, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So, where, where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck, God damn it. Okay, well, let's, let's just give Gene the update. No way, man. I just, I bought nothing. Do you even know what you're looking for? It was supposed to be a jetpack, but you fuckers don't have it. Even though I think it's right here in the box. Give me this one. A painting? Looks like it's free. All oh, right. not for sale. All right. Come back soon. I feel like I just got robbed. Did you restock yet? Give me more. All right. Hey. You're getting a little annoying, okay? Well, what are you, addicted to alien cum or something? I didn't even know that was possible. It's true what they say. You learn something new about alien cum every day. That's what makes it so great. But I don't have any more, so beat it. I don't know what you want from me, man. You gave, you gave me the first hit free, and now I'm addicted. You, you're the one that did this to me. It's your fault. How you, how you go patrolling the streets with one gallon? You gotta have at least six. Unprepared merchant, my goodness, just as worse as the pawn shop. Gene, I got some bad news. I got scammed. You took my money, gave me no product. Here's a gallon How'd to come, though. Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. Explore it and get some rest in your bed. Okay, we could explore, but let's just skip all that. I'll probably go ahead and unlock some chests and do some things, you know, off stream. But, um, yeah, let's just go to bed. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Oh, what the hell? 
Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Now, if anyone ever wants me to replay this game and have specific guns out for specific things, let me know. I'll happily replay it just to hear some dialogue, because I am curious to what other guns will say. But what the fuck? Why well, am on the roof? Oh, I got the jetpack. Alright, partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Let's see. Hold A to fly, yep. Right. Holy shit, this rules! Oh. What's up? Damn, you're just like a Tony Hawk Tom Jet Track Pro. What? Tap yeah, down while in the air to show, hover. I've never said that. No, I don't want a TV show. Well, we got seven seasons. Oh, so cool. All of them. It's called the Michael Show. Michael. And this is live right now? Yeah, this is live. Oh, man, you know how I get nervous. I'll leave it. Okay, bye, Wait, buddy. What? Bye, bye. All right. Uh, maybe let's try that again. People will just watch it. Oh, I'll go back to my roof. I did not read it. Gonna follow me if I, go get I didn't finish reading it because I'm dumb dumb. Nice. So press A and rise to the jetpack max height. You got it. Uh, jetpack. Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You could fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have yeah, here. We cool. put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. I sure hope there is. And broke his crown. Alrighty. I think this is the front of the house. This guy is still giving me a ticket. I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fuck more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot though, right? Who is this dude? Uh, Tweek's probably hot. Tweek's probably ugly. I don't fucking know. Maybe he's hot, but he's an alien. So I'm gonna Just say ugly. Just say something. Any... Wait, you haven't even met him. Why are you calling him gross? You know I've got a whole life going on here. While well, you're off having fun doing whatever it is you do. No, I'm risking right. my life. My boyfriend's ugly. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Um... She's just trying to help. You really don't give a fuck, man, so stay out of her business. We're all living under the same roof, and that makes us family. And it makes her business my business. I'm the man of the house, so she needs to do what I say. And before anyone accuses me of being a misogynist, yeah, I know I'm a misogynist. We all know I'm a misogynist. That's bad, and I'm working on it. But this is about me being right and your sister being wrong. Listen to yourself. I can make my own decisions. I don't know why you think you're suddenly some father figure to me just because you're crashing on my couch and eating my diary. Oh yeah, I said eating. He's been eating pages out of my diary. So what? My species eats paper. It's delicious. Who gives a shit? I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. 
Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off! Just grow up and get used to me and Twig! Come on, tell me. Have we got a bounty, yes or no? What the hell is all this shit? Look, Lizzie, you can take whoever the fuck you want. I just want to kill people. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean, okay? Can we just save the human race? Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Yes, I do. I don't care about what you guys do in this house. What the hell? Oh, we got a doctor. Sure. All right, oh, he's like a worm in a suit. Skinny. You're all going to need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh shit, another Gatlian. That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. All right, what we got here? Hey there, detective Tommy mode. Hunter. It's me, Sudo again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly, with the fucking detective mode, why, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately. And no matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene. Uh, uh, talk to Blim residents. All right, I'm going to end it here because we about to hit the 30-minute mark. I want to say thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. More is on the way. Until the next video, goodbye for now.